to Turbin. And the rebound taken down by Blake Griffin. And there's the pass, and Jordan. So Paul to Jordan. That could have happened to Gr Blake Griffin was having a terrible game like he did in his mind. Here is Paul trying to get it to Griffin again. Gets it back. Wide open. Hits. I think Blake Griffin, the best thing for him is to have a terrible game, to stick with it. Finally defending Paul. Pulls up and hits. Paul now with six points to lead the Clippers. And Foy has four, so ten. This is a three. And finally, it comes down to the hands of Paul. Randy Foy. Randy Foy with the lay-in and once again a seven-point lead. An opponent that is much smaller than him. We say mouse in the house. And if you have someone smaller on him, take him to the post and post him up. First Paul. Nick Young. For three. Whoa. Wow. I just saw. He's done that before. Oh my goodness. Nick, this might be the most consistent from that spot and taking advantage of it off the pick and roll. Now. And here's Paul with the lay in. Chris Paul shaking up, hit on the face. And it comes back to Chris Paul who hits the three. Chris Paul with two minutes remaining in the first half with a three to bring the Clippers to within one point. On the court right now is Jordan. Four things happen because of the speed. Under a minute to go in the first half. Paul for three. He's got it. Paul with his second three of the game. Chris Paul, you might say the heart and soul of this Clippers team. I definitely would say he's the heart and soul of the team. And I also say he's in aggressive mode. And when he's aggressive, everybody's in trouble. Feel good automatically. There is Paul. Alley oop to Jordan. Oh! And the basket counts and the foul. Talk about exclamation point right there. Oh, that's what I love to see. Guys being aggressive, going to the hole. Great pass by the point guard. And they communicated this. They communicated this after he missed the pass to Blake off the pick and roll. Jordan came over and said to him, I'm going to come up under, look for me for the ball. And Allen is on Paul. That's a matchup that. Lionel Hollins didn't want to see, and Paul with the basket. What did he tell us? Uh, <laughs> he said, my coaches want Allen on Paul. I don't, and I gave way to them, and uh, I don't think you'll see it tonight. Well, uh, uh, yeah, well, maybe that time might have been a mistake, but you, <laughs> the lack of jumping ability has been a great rebound, especially offensively. What a fake oh. by Paul. Oh. Chris Paul with a great fake. And Chris Paul. Playing up to his NBA All-Star status now with 20. I don't even know how to describe this because he faked me out as well. I guess he looked to the right after coming. Allen went up in the air so to have energy. Cutters have to cut. You cannot stand stagnant. And that time everyone stayed stagnant and they were allowed to come out. Paul with three. Chris Paul with his third three of the game. And now it's a two-point affair as we... And there is a basket and the foul. Chris Paul gets clobbered as he connects on a three from the corner and a chance for the four-point play. This is the same man that was down 20 in the game and told coach do not take him out. The same guy that came to this team with aspirations of a championship and wanting to go to the playoffs. And it's the same guy that's playing that way right now. Spates hit him head on. Nearly seven minutes remaining. And there is Mo Williams with a three. Mo Williams hitting his first three-point basket of the game. And the Clippers. Eight-point game. Nick Young. A three by Young. 